let's do the chords for Eric Clapton, Behind the Mask. <laughs> a repeated sequence that takes place throughout most of the song and what I'm playing there is I'm playing it all on the D, G and B strings. So first one I'm playing is a G sharp chord um, just on 6, 5, 4 and then just barring on 6 for a C sharp. G sharp again and C sharp again. Back to G sharp, back to C sharp. Then playing the same pattern but this time going down to E. So I'm playing 2, 1 and open for an E and then just barring, barring with my second finger to get an A. Then moving up to an F sharp, then doing the same again, this time an F sharp and a B chord. And then and then for the last one I play F sharp again, B again, F sharp again. B again, twice, so two Bs, and move back to a G sharp, so. So the whole thing slow is. Okay, and then we've got the um, kind of bridge chords or chorus chords, uh, bridge I guess you'd call it. Um, we've got an A minor, uh, an A major, sorry, an A major seventh chord. Two bars of that, and then to an E major seventh chord. And we play that four times, so it's, so it's one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two. Just those A major seven to E major seven. Third time, and then on the fourth time, A major seven again, but last time we play, we go chromatically down. So we go E major seven, then just E flat, D, and then we're back into. So, back into the main riff, and over the chorus when it goes Who Do You Love, there's a little kind of bluesy lick, um, Who Do You Love, is it, him? Is it me? So, uh, just over the chorus he plays a little all around the C sharp blues scale. Classic Clapton, just bending up on 11, bend up and release, pull off to an E, so bending from F sharp up to G sharp, releasing, pulling off to E, landing on C sharp. And then a couple of lines later we just get a simple bend up and down, F sharp, G sharp, back again. And the last one, very similar, same again, but at the end, just do a little flick back up. Who do you know? Is it me, babe? Is it him? I don't know. Um, I played it slightly differently that time. I don't know. There you go. Um, but you can kind of put your own licks in there. That's the beauty of uh, learning this type of song, because uh, you can 
do your own thing. And a later date, we'll take a look at the guitar solo in this song. But for now, I hope you enjoy the chords.